Hello, welcome back to another video. Today I will show you how to uh, remove objects in your videos using Photoshop. Alright, let's get to it. Alright, so here I have a video of this guy running. And I'm just going to remove him and them two from the video and just keep them three here. But if I was to use Mocha or anything else, it would be a little, it wouldn't look quite right. So let's see if I was to remove them using Mocha. The problem is that since Mocha can reimagine them and animate them, doing the same thing they were doing is just going to look kind of awkward like they're warping so since they're moving and mocha cannot reimagine those pixels it's it's not the best option to use mocha pro for this now if i was to remove them that could be possible because the trees in the back they're still and the pixels are moving so moving them using mocha pro would Moving them using Mocha Pro would work, but to remove them and keep him here, it, it wouldn't look quite right. So we're gonna remove them all. Okay, and the easy way to do that would be using Photoshop. So let's go ahead and first thing we're going to do is take a still image of this let's go ahead and take a screenshot of this make sure you know where you're saving it okay now next thing is we're going to need a picture of the building back here so let's go ahead and Take a screenshot of this here as well. Okay, so now let's open Photoshop. Okay, so I have a picture of both frames. So what we're going to do now is add mask, add a mask to both of them. Okay, so for this, we're going to get the brush and we're going to start removing them. Since the trees in the back, they're all still, everything matches, so you shouldn't have a problem. Make sure you delete the shadow from here, from the guy that was running earlier. You make sure you don't go over on this side, because that's the next, next layer. So this is what you pretty much want. Okay, so once you do that, go ahead and export it. All right, now go back to Premiere Pro and Bring back those that picture you just saved. Can okay, I add it on top of your video? Make sure you stretch it across the length of the video as well. We're gonna do the whole 12 seconds. Okay, 
Now we're going to add a mask to this layer. Just click over here. Or you can use the pen. So whichever one you want. I am going to use Okay, so whichever one you want, you can use the square. So what you need to do is go ahead and drag it right here. So what you need to do is move this all the way at the end. So you know where to cover him from. So now you stretch this. Make sure it goes outside the boundaries so you don't see him coming into frame. Okay, so once you do that. So at the end, you kind of see him. What you can do is click on the mask. So he comes into frame right here. Just click on the mask and Need to stretch it a little bit more at another point. Or you can use the pen and just get very detailed around them. And, or you could just cut this frame. So, as soon as. Okay, so if you move that frame a little, the mask over a little bit, you should be able to cover it. Or you could just delete this if it's too hard, but if you use the pen, you can you go around them more, with more precision. So that's how you can remove objects using Photoshop. And this is just removing simple objects that there's no movement in the back. This was easy to use Photoshop for, but not every time it'll work for. So you just have to know which techniques to use and that way you can apply them with ease. All right, I hope this video was helpful. And if it was, let me know in the comments. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos like this.